All right, Darren, tell us about the need of haters. Well, haters are very much needed. Just like we have a job to do as Christians and as ministers, uh, we need haters. Haters are very much needed. So, uh, you know, they have a job to do just like we do. And uh, as long as, you know, you have some haters, see, when you don't have haters, you know, and they have nothing to speak on you, that means, you know, you're not doing something. But when you're doing something and God is progressing and moving in your life, there's going to be the devil. He's going to use those haters. So you use those haters as, a, as your footstool. You use those haters as a motivator, you know, because if, if you're not doing nothing right, they don't have anything to hate on. And, and if you're doing, you know, if, if, and if you're doing nothing, what is there for them to hate on? So as long as you have haters, that means you're doing something right. You know what I'm saying? The devil will never mess with anybody that's, that belongs to him. He will always mess and send people to mess with those that are striving and those who are trying to do God's work and God's will. So I always remember, you need those haters. Let them haters do their job. Invite them. I invite them all. You need those. Because that lets you know you're on the right path.